In this program, we are required to print output like this. This program is almost similar to the previous one, but here the output of this program will display a complete square. Before we start the programs, let me explain you that this will be the first character. It is one of the ASCII characters. Then this also is a ASCII character. So these are chain of similar characters that we are required to print. And after that, this also is another ASCII character similar to this one and this one. So these four corners are different ASCII characters. And for this row character, we are just repeating it. Similarly for the column, we have this special ASCII character. So to achieve this program, we are just required to simply print this ASCII character first and after that from the second location till 79th location we are going to print this in a loop and once this character is printed we will print this corner and then on the next line we will print this column character followed by spaces using a loop from 2 to 79 and then again printing the column value so this row will be printed for 24 times and after that this special symbol will be printed then we will repeat this symbol from second till 79th column and after that we will print this character so in the program we are printing this character that will be starting off your square and then from second till 79th column we are going to print this horizontal bar and on the 80th we are going to close it is this character on the next line we are going to print this vertical column and then spaces and again the ending column so that will print this row so this row we are going to print for 2 to 24 times and once that is done now we are required to print this character so we are printing it over here and then this horizontal character from second to 79th column and finally printing this will complete your square so using these ascii values we have printed this complete square apart from these characters there are other character symbols also which you can just check and play around with this program you can try printing different shapes and sizes on the output screen using those different ascii characters you can challenge yourself to print different shapes and sizes to be printed on output screen using different sets of ascii characters